no, there was quite a big build-up to the game. Uh, we knew what both teams would be throwing at each other, um, trying to dominate physically, um, and then at times take the ball wide. Um, I'll have to go back and have a look at the stats and, result, and the results, but uh, it looks like it might have come down to errors on the day and penalties. We did work on uh, our set phase in the week. Uh, we know that's a platform that we need to build our consistency from, but we also know if we can disrupt and uh, spoil the set phase, it puts us in a very strong position. Um, I think in certain areas of the game, we managed to do that today um, and help put us on the front foot. Absolutely, we've got a lot of supporters that come down to False Bay. I think we like to think of ourselves as a community club. Uh, the truth is that people can spend their, uh, their Saturdays in many, many ways. Um, and a lot of people come down to, to spend their afternoon here. And we just want to make sure that they enjoy their afternoon. It's not just about the rugby, it's about the atmosphere that you can create and provide. And I think it's the same for the opposition too. We've got to make sure that it's a happy environment for anyone that comes down here, uh, which is why we go ham and tongs with each other on the field, but we make sure that we're hospitable and uh, we put a beer or a Coke in the, the opposition's hand after the game. Yeah, I don't think it's just a captaincy thing to, to lift their energy. Um, the truth is we semi-professional rugby players and there's so much that we can put into a week in terms of practice. And so we understand when it comes to 80 minutes on a Saturday, it's all, it's all about energy, um, whether it's defense and attack. And we've made it a thing within our team to make sure that we motivate motivating one another in different areas uh, during the game. No, it's uh, a, a win for us against Durban is massive, um, especially considering we picked up a bonus point. The truth is this league is so tight. I know a lot of people talk about it being the hardest league in the country, um, but the truth is you lose one game and you've lost your, se you've lost your league, you've lost your season. Um, so when we lost to Martis by one point, we knew we had a long road ahead of us, and we just knew we wanted to collect our bonus points uh, along the way and uh, let the rugby guards decide the rest.